Good morning one and all welcome to the video in this video I am going to be telling you about an open source gensim word to vec uh, plotting library in python so you know I, I i was i was reading a lot of blogs uh, like people were doing a lot of work in order to basically uh, do plotting right uh, whenever you're using nlp that is natural language processing i decided uh, you know let's why not help make a class that can help the community or the society and here is the code so isn't it difficult or tedious to do all the pre-processing for your data for just plotting it because they are into your higher dimensions, maybe n dimensions. And for plotting, you need two dimensions. With this library, everything is a cup of cake. Let's look at it. So all you have to do is basically, this only works for Gensim, okay? So if you're using Gensim word to vec module, um, all you have to do is first of all, load your model or okay. So make sure um, once you load your model, you have to create an instance of your class. So basically there is a class called as Gensim word to vec plotter, which takes the model, Gensim model. So here you can see I'm basically passing that uh, Gensim um, model. Once you pass the Gensim model, what you can do is basically, you just have to use one line of command. Helper is equal to, once you create an instance, you can just say uh, dot plot scatter, which is gonna give you a beautiful plot of your uh, what to wake up or basically what to wake model the, that is machine learning model and with one line of command like you can say helper dot plot scatter underscore words and if you provide the size as 30 so it's gonna do all the plot basically it's gonna do all the same scatter plot but with the words as well so if you increase the number of size if you say 40 it's gonna put 40 words in that graph amazing guys amazing right so easy before that, you had to do a lot of tedious work, pre-processing, reduce the dimensionality using PCA. No worry at all now. Hey, want to get a pandas data frame? No problem, I got you. So just say helper.get pandas data frame. So this is gonna be returning an entire pandas data frame of your Gensim model. So it's gonna give you a word and their basically coordinates, a two dimension coordinates of your words. Everything is amazing. And this is the actual library that does all the heavy lifting for you. So yeah, all it does all the PCA, reduce the dimensionality and stuff like that. So uh, yeah, so this uh, code or the notebook is there on my blog, on my GitHub, kindly check it out. Or it, I'll also try to upload it on my LinkedIn. Usually every week I make some modules or libraries for people. So yeah, kindly check it out. And if you have any more questions, uh, let me know. So this is a small library or a helper tool that will help a, uh, that will help a data scientist to visualize their data much, much faster instead of writing all, all of that tedious code when they are using Gensim module. Hope you have enjoyed it. If so, do give a like. Uh, make sure to click the subscribe button on the down. And um, uh, by the way, my name is Samil Cha. I'm a full stack software engineer. And if you have any more questions, uh, please feel free to list your questions in the comments and I would be very happy to assist you. Once again, thank you for watching. See you next time.